what is going on guys and welcome back to another video and in this video it's going to be a little bit different than my previous ones usually i make tutorials on how to edit inside of after effects but today i'm actually going to be showing you guys how to optimize your after effects now this has been a pretty commonly asked question in my comments so i decided to finally answer it and kind of show you guys how i optimize my after effects to make it run a lot faster i'll leave the specs to my computer down in the description below so you know what hardware i'm using a few of the settings might look a bit different if you're using a mac but i'm on windows so if you're on windows all the settings should be pretty similar as mine. So I'm going to start off by going into file, project settings, and then video rendering and effects. And I like to keep this on the Mercury GPU acceleration. And you might not have this feature if you don't have a GPU in your computer. You may only be able to use the software, but I do recommend using this if you have this available. And then these other settings are pretty basic. You don't need to adjust any of that. But yeah, this is the main thing you want to make sure you have on. I just hit OK. Now let's go into edit. And preferences and let's just go into general and for the previews here i like to keep my adaptive resolution limit to one six now in the media and disk cache it's nice to have your maximum disk cache set to a pretty high value here i have mine set to 110 gigabytes and that's because i have a dedicated folder just for my after effects disk cache here so i would recommend getting an ssd just for after effects so you can store your disk cache on that and it is important to frequently empty that disk cache because it will eventually get full now in the memory and performance is where we can change just a few more settings here now i have 32 gigabytes of ram you may have more or less so the more ram you have in your computer the faster after effects will actually run and then i like to have my ram reserved for other applications pretty low i set this down to six gigabytes but you can mess with this and see what works best for you and i also have enable multi-frame rendering enabled this basically speeds up the rendering times and the preview render times inside of after effects but i do think this is kind of a new feature inside of after effects so you do want to make sure you're on the latest version of after effects and yeah that's pretty much it for here so we can just hit okay now a few other settings you can adjust when you're playing back your videos are inside of just like the workspace here in after effects so we can adjust the quality playback here from full to quarter so as you can see the quality gets decreased <laughs> quite a bit here when you bring it down to quarter but if you're experiencing kind of a lag when you're playing back your video then i'd recommend kind of changing this as well as going into the preview here and setting the resolution to something pretty low like third or quarter but if you have a pretty powerful computer then you can use like half or even full but i'd recommend just using something pretty low another thing we can toggle on here is adaptive resolution this will lower down the resolution quite a bit but it does help when you're scrubbing through your timeline here kind of just helps make everything smoother but yeah those are pretty much all the settings i like to use inside of after effects to help speed up my workflow if you guys know any other ways to kind of speed up after effects and kind of your workflow then make sure to drop a comment down below and let me know if you guys have any other solutions but hopefully this does help speed up your after effects just a little bit more because to be honest after effects is a pretty slow program but if this did help then make sure to drop a like and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out